Welcome back to Tainan Municipal Stadium. Come on, why he got the barbecue over yeah, there? It's still not fair. Come on. Why the Mandarin broadcasting got the meat and got the dinner we don't have? Right. They be, yeah, we better get an uh, explanation from 11 Sports. Come on. It's not fair. Yeah, I'm calling Jason, the Chinese broadcaster. 2 0. Oh. Come on, there is a barbecue. Oh, now so the cheer to get the barbecue, but not us? Come on, Lion. Come to us, please. Make a, yeah, make a trip out to the booth. Saba boy. It's on the wheelchair? I think it's just a cart. To China Municipal Stadium. Look at that outfield stance. There is a barbecue stand. Come on. They had the barbecue stand in the outfield bleacher. Yeah, that has we had nothing. I know. I have a cup of coffee, which uh, we had to pay for ourselves. Welcome back to Tainan Municipal Stadium here in Taiwan. We smell different now. Yes, we finally got some food. You got your soba fish. Pan fry or, Pan fry bar or barbecue. Love and barbecue it. with toast. I love it. That's a Taiwanese style of barbecue. Yeah, you uh, have some pork, I believe, and then you uh, you stuck it in, in the in a uh, between two breads. Yeah, two, it's like a like barbe a barbecue sandwich. sandwich. Mm, I'm hungry now. So am I. The booth is not full of the smell yeah. of delicious food. Yeah, very tempting. You might have to do your. You might have to do this broadcast on your own for the next couple of innings. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, no. So you named after Keith Hernandez? Actually, no. Uh, no? Keith Ben Horn, if I remember, a uh, basketball player from the New Jersey Nets. And when I first moved to the states, I was, uh, you know, did speak a lot of English. So I, you know, so I was, so anything I, I was able to watch is uh, sports games. So, you know, I was a Nets fan, the Mets fan, the Jets fan. And, you know, at that time, you know, Nets wasn't very good, but they had this power forward and Keith Van Horn. I was like, oh, this, this is a good player. I like him. So I named myself Keith. It's unique. Now my Chinese classmate is named Keith. Oh, inside. Two account. Now, do you know Keith Van Horn or have you heard of the guy? No. No? I'm not a big basketball fan. Okay, yeah. And it, I know Keith Folk. Keith Folk. Keith Folk. Yeah, but Keith Hernandez is very... It's, it's funny how you mention Keith Hernandez because, like, you know, later on, you know, when I, after I started calling myself Keith, a lot of people that I meet, because they know I'm a Mets fan, Yeah. they ask, well, hey, are you, do, you name yourself, do you name yourself after Keith Hernandez? Matt. Mr. Matt. Yeah. The Uni Lions have the Ryan. Ryan the Lion. Uh, Where's the Saba boy? I'm not sure. He's taking a day off, maybe, because I think the uh, the open jump is making oh, appearance. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. That's so maybe, the reason. Maybe he's not his turn in the rotation. <laughs> yeah. Maybe you hope to see him. He weekend. got a briefer. Maybe you hope to see him over the weekend, because he's certainly become a thing favorite. Also on the Twitter world, apparently. Yeah. Saba boy. It's kind of scary a little bit. Well, his backside is, still, his backside <laughs> is scary, you know? Yeah. Like the front side is okay. It's a fish head. But if you look at the backside, it takes... It's a cut open fish head. Yeah, there's a bone there. Yeah. Oh, well, it's creepy, but it's also kind of. It's quirky. Yeah, it's quirky. It's a fun fact, fun story that he once missed the home play after home run trout. I was there. He was there? I was there. I was uh, I was a string coach for the Eat Out Rhinos at that time, and he hit one against one of our pitchers. And uh, he hit an apple homer in Xinzhuang. And uh, he, as he, as he was approaching home play, as he's a, he's a, he's a well-known Christian. So, he, he usually give the credits. He usually give the credit to uh, higher up. So he does. As he was doing that, he walked right over home play and did not touch it. And uh, our catcher at that time uh, caught it. And uh, so they, so we appeal at home play, and he got out. Welcome back, Saba boy. And Saba boy is very popular. Overseas fans. Yeah, Saba boy, he stands for uh, milkfish in Taiwanese. And as, 
as the fans that have been following our broadcast, Sama Fish is definitely one of the featured food here in, uh, in Thailand City. But yeah, his back is like spooky. Yeah, because, you can see you know, the bones a, and yeah, the Yeah, he cut in half. Almost like a sashimi. <laughs> sashimi. And welcome back to Thailand Municipal Stadium. Do you miss Saba Boy? I actually, I do actually. And I... And uh, from what I've heard, he's become a fan favorite from those who've been watching overseas. He's drawn a lot of attention. Yeah, I'm wondering where can I buy his like souvenirs or stuff, like toy or well, I think he's stuffed the, toys. I think it's the official, one of the official mascot for the Thailand city government. So uh, I think that will be an answer for the uh, Thailand city to answer.